Hello YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome back to my playthrough of Modern Warfare 3. We are approaching near the end of the game, and we're going to be doing the mission Eye of the Storm. Maneuver behind enemy lines to the church tower. Let's do it. Hardened. Did a man talk? They always talk. We got names, dates, locations. Bolt gave us everything. Even forgot her. It seems your hunch was right, Captain. Makarov's already making friends. He's meeting with his top advisor six hours from now. Location is the Hotel Lustig. It's in the center of the city near the old square. We have tier one groups assigned to handle this, but I don't think they'll make it in time. But you're close. Very. I'll contact you when it's done. Makarov's council all together in the middle of a war zone. Sounds convenient. Overconfidence makes you careless. We'll infiltrate along two separate routes, so you and Yuri head for the church and provide overwatch. The city's locked down tight. We'll need a back door. Leave that to me. Welcome to Prague, gents. The resistance is expecting us. Have a click to the moment. Let's get this over with. So this is in in Prague, the Czech um, Hold up. Czech Republic. They've already taken prisoners. They're moving fast. We need to be faster. Keep it tight, lad. Use the boats for cover. Move under the docks. The storm will keep us quiet. So here we go, we got a familiar face now. It's Kamarov, remember him from Modern Warfare 1? I'm really happy that they brought back Kamarov. Uh, I was wondering where he was in Modern Warfare 2 and then Modern Warfare 3 we got our answer. So he's helping the resistance here. So the first intel is coming up on this part. Patrol up ahead. You get one, I'll take the other. On you. He's down. Another sniper. Don't draw his attention. Chopper, quick through here. So first intel is gonna be right here. Moving on the street. 
Keep your eyes high. Snipers are everywhere. We'll keep an eye out. Let's go. So in this part, you you see just how brutal the Russian occupation is. Get down. They're inside the building. God, this thing has a red dot sight also on it. Damn. Oh, this part's gonna be good. Oh, what the? Well, I, um, uh, I don't know how I got detected there. Um, you're supposed to climb over that. I'm guessing I'm supposed to let Soap climb over it first, but... Yeah, I think it was my mistake that I didn't let Soap go first. This part's gonna be one of the best parts of, of Modern Warfare right now. Price and Kamarov are up there. And that, yep. And there's actually a pretty cool Spec Ops mission, I remember, where you have to save the Resistance members in, um, uh, in Modern Warfare 3, and, uh, Captain Price says in that mission that, um, uh, that they, they saved us, so we gotta, we, we have to also save them. Yuri, scout ahead. Builders are going to take much more 
got here. Got most of them. I just love the soundtrack that plays during this mission. Ah oh, man, damn. Had another incident there. Um Now we move up. Oh, it looks like another BTR is up there. Oh, it's destroyed, okay. So that's basically where the Spec Ops mission leads into it. The Spec Ops mission is after this, um, uh, because the Resistance gets overrun. So now immediately go into the next mission here, and this is uh, probably the most infamous mission in Modern Warfare 3, is this one here. Which vehicle will he be in? They constantly rotate for security. We won't know until he steps out. You seem to know a lot about Makarov. Alpha 1, radio check over. Bravo 1, copy. We're dug in with line of sight. Right. Camera offs our eyes and ears inside the hotel. Once he gives us the nod, we'll kick this off. What do you see? Bugger all, mate. Looks like Makarov's late for his own funeral. Sit tight until we get a clean shot. Then you can put as many rounds on him as you like. It'll only take one.
Blood Brothers. Pretty, um, uh, pretty, uh, good name for the mission. Stopping in front of the hotel. Do you see him? Aye, there's a bastard in the third vehicle. Shite. I think he's looking right at us. Easy. Just sit tight. They're pulling into the garage now. All right, camera off. You're up. Camera off's not responding. I <sighs> probably forgot to switch it on. Doesn't matter. Macross here. We move forward with the plan. I'm in position. Ready. Yuri, find Price in your scope. He's at the top of the hotel. Uh, we got you. So, uh, the first time that I was playing this mission, back in 2011, I knew something was gonna go wrong, because I know Macross, that type of guy, he's... He, he would know that Captain Price is gonna try to kill him here. Makarov, Makarov is very evil, but he's also very smart. And so he wouldn't allow himself to be caught in a bad situation like this. So Kamarov uh, was captured and tied with a bomb and sent up the elevator. So you heard what um, uh, Makarov said. Yuri, my friend, you never should have come here. When I was playing this the first time, I knew that Yuri was somehow involved with Makarov just from that dialogue. But I didn't think he was a traitor, um, because the fact that Yuri would have gotten blown up in the tower too. So now a lot of you guys um, uh, are in this, uh, a lot of people didn't understand this scene and they didn't understand if you look at this mission, Soap's leaving a lot of blood, huge blood trail and people are probably wondering how from that fall did that happen, it, it opened up the wound that he had from General Shepard's um, knife, so the wound wasn't fully healed, remember this is only like, you know, this is only maybe what, like two weeks after Modern Warfare 3? Last intel, only intel in this mission is here.
Come on, open the door, Captain Price. So yeah, um, a lot of people are would be very surprised how much blood the human body has. A lot of people don't realize how much blood people have in them. And so people can lose a lot of blood very fast. Grenade launchers on these. Okay. He's tied through the window. Now this part's gonna get ridiculous. Make sure you take cover here quickly. I remember this back from 2011. Use this basketball court as a bit of cover and just start picking them off. Fire it in bursts, because you're gonna get overrun really quickly if you don't. This is definitely one of the saddest Modern Warfare scenes. Probably actually the most sad Modern Warfare scene, now that you think about it. And so this part of the story here, this was very well done. So Yuri, a new character that was just added, they added like a whole detailed story behind him. I was young and patriotic when I first met Vladimir Makarov. Yuri, wake up. Zakaev wouldn't want you to miss this. This deal will generate millions for our cause. Money can buy many things, even power. The road to our future begins here, my friend. This is from, remember, the Pripyat mission. Zakaev gets his arm blown off here. And, um, notice how when Makarov talks, he's in red. That he's an enemy. Yuri remembers him as an enemy. Zakaev never forgot what we did for you, but our reward was power. But power corrupts. 
and then Makarov was the one who gave Al Assad the order to detonate the nuke. Today, we show the world our true strength. Perhaps it will give you some as well. Is everything ready? Do it. Thousands of souls extinguished by the push of a button. Yuri's story links Modern Warfare 1, 2, and 3 so nicely together. This is only the beginning. This wasn't war. It was madness. I know what you have done, Yuri. I know what you have told them. My friend, my ally, my betrayer. What happens here today will change the world forever. Nothing stop this. Not even you. And so this also shows you what an absolute scumbag Private Allen was. That Private Allen was there, and he made no attempt to stop it. Um, because remember what I said, Private Allen was a bad person as well. P Private Allen was going to follow any order given to him by General Shepard no matter what. And he probably would have gone along with General Shepard's master plan if General Shepard hadn't betrayed him. And what's really cool is in the Modern Warfare 2 remaster, if you actually go back, you can actually see Yuri trying to stop Makarov in the, in the no-Russian mission. I was a soldier of Russia, not a taker of innocent lives. But in his eyes, this marked me as the enemy. Okay, Yuri. You bought yourself some time. For now. So, uh, we are very close to the end of the game. Uh, I guess we'll leave it off here. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everyone. Have a wonderful day, guys.